In this video, we are going to learn how to create thermal structural coupling analysis in SimSolid. For the sake of this demo, we'll use this PCB model, which is already been set up. Let's take a few seconds to review the model. Material has been assigned to all the parts. And connections are also well established between all the parts. Let's begin by creating a thermal analysis. Pick thermal analysis from analysis toolbar. We are going to apply volume heat and thermal convection to the top and bottom faces of this board. Let's apply volume heat to one of the blocks. Select the part and set the volume heat to 100 watt per meter cube. Next, pick thermal convection. Select the bottom face of this board. Set the ambient temperature to 25 and the convective coefficient to 10. Repeat this for the top face of the board. Thermal analysis setup is complete now. Let's go ahead and uh, run the analysis. The results are also available. You can choose to plot temperature, flux, or thermal gradient. Let's plot temperature. You can also use pick info to see the results at a specific point or phases. Select the points of interest and view the temperature at these points. We'll use this thermal analysis and create a structural thermal coupling analysis. Pick structural linear from analysis toolbar. Fix the board at either ends using immobile support. Select thermal boundary condition from analysis workbench. SimSolid allows different ways to apply thermal load. One is to link with the existing thermal analysis and other is to apply temperature to the parts. We'll use the first option and link with existing thermal analysis. All the available thermal analysis in the design study will be listed here. Select the one and uh, hit OK to complete the thermal boundary condition. As you can see, the link to thermal analysis is shown next to the thermal load. Structural analysis setup is also now complete. Let's go ahead and solve the structural analysis. The results are available. Let's plot displacement magnitude and view the animation. Thank you.